depending on how much RAM you actually get and the type of RAM you actually get, there's there's usually two dark ones and then two lighter ones. If you get two, again, read your manual because it will actually tell you what you need to do. So you got one clip, two clip. Most of the time, you're gonna wanna put one here and the other in the last slot. Linus made a video on this. Linus ended up saying that it goes through your memory, but sometimes it can go up and then it bounces back and it causes problems because of that. So your RAM is gonna have, you see that empty black slot right there? So as you can see on this motherboard, there's kind of a, it's, it's hard for me to show you, but at the bottom there's like less. So because there's less on the bottom portion of that, you're gonna want to, it's gonna make a loud clip, but that's normal, don't worry about it. It seems like you're breaking it, it really does. Just normal PC building stuff. I promise you, you're not gonna break it. Okay, that's all the RAM. Now, if you're, motherboard company is awesome they will send you magnetic screwdrivers so now we're gonna go ahead and throw our NVMe now depending on some motherboards depending on the one that you get have uh, they have different NVMe heat sinks so you guys can see like when if you run into problems your manual can be your best friend 